Hey you guys, it's your girl Leslie and I'm back with another video. Y'all are probably wondering where have you been? I have been busy doing prom stuff. As y'all seen, I have my nails done. Y'all will see that in the vlog of the get ready with me for prom. Um, just to let y'all know that what I've been doing, um, I have been doing two videos basically. Been doing this one right now and then my prom, getting like starting my prom. So yeah, uh, that's what I've been doing. So I decided to do this video and get this out so I can focus on the next one. So if y'all know, today is Monday, prom is Saturday. So today, today is Monday, April 25th. Um, now y'all probably wondering, okay, girl, what's the video? It's basically a 15 tips to get a hundred subscribers on YouTube. Um, I asked y'all which video I want to see. Y'all choose this one. So y'all got it. Um, but before I jump into it, make sure you like, comment, subscribe, and make sure y'all, make sure y'all have post notifications on so you know when I post. And I just want to let y'all know that I have started the prom vlog and get ready with me or whatever. So, just to let y'all know, y'all will see it. So, stay tuned. Okay, y'all. So, I have all my stuff on my iPhone. So, I'll just read off, you know, the tips I'm giving y'all off this. And, yeah. So, I'll just go ahead and get started. So, the first one is be yourself. Um, completely always be yourself. Um, as y'all seen, I try not to cuss on my channel that much because as y'all seen in the getting my teeth extracted um I did say bad words because that's Leslie uh yeah that is me will not lie I do cuss but now that I'm on camera I'm not trying to cuss that much so might slip every once in a while but completely always be yourself Okay, the second one is uh, make your channel look nice. Um, make sure, you know, you have a, a banner, a nice profile. We can see your picture. Um, I have trouble with that, trying to pick out a picture that y'all can actually see my face. That's the real hard part that I have. Um, but just make sure it looks nice and neat, like you're like a movie star or whatever, because this is your channel and you want to make sure it looks nice and you know, catching. <laughs> I sound like I'm in school, but still. Number three is promote your videos in your end screen. Um, I, I just now recently started this year doing that um, since I have a laptop. I do my end screens. Sometimes I forget to do them, but um, make sure you do your end, your end screen so they can pick another video and click on it and yeah, they'll see more of you and just make sure you put that in your uh, videos. Number four is promote yourself. Promote, promote, promote. I say this in like almost every one of my videos. Promote yourself is what's going to probably help you in the long run because I have my TikTok and on my Instagram I have them both linked. Um, my Facebook is for family and family only so if y'all try to send me a friend request I probably would deny it unless I'm super super close with you and you're like family. Um, so just to let y'all know, that is, that is why I deny some of requests because it's for family and friends only and I'm hardly ever on Facebook, so, and I do get on there for YouTube, uh, groups, that's about it though, but if you, like, send me a, a friend request, I probably won't, yeah, because it's just, just family and friends only, but like I said, promote yourself. Uh, Instagram, Snapchat, Snapchat I've been promoting on there too, I just started that, um, uh, TikTok, um, do like a TikTok video of your channel, hey, go subscribe, always promote yourself because no one else is probably going to unless they're really close to you. Number five is pay attention to your SEO score, I just, someone just, um, uh, told me about this, so. Your SEO score is basically your tags and your description and, how, and like basically all your tags to reach, um, you know, a good uh, setting score, I guess you would say. But um, it can't be read. You see it on the laptop. I don't know if you can see it on the phone, 
but your SEO score will show like right there on the side. Um, if it's low, you need to put more tags in your description or more tags in general. Um, I've started putting tags in my um, title so it can push more views, I guess, um, because if you don't put tags in the title, it's gonna like give you a, like a 40 or a 27 and that's red. So I try to get it to 85. Like my last video was at 85 um, because I put tags and everything. And just make make sure you pay attention to that because it means it means more people gets to view it and yeah, you have enough tags and it just helps you. It helps me. Um, but just pay attention to that SEO score. Six is produce yeah produce high quality uh, videos yeah. Um, but make sure you're, you are recording in 4K if you have an iPhone 12 like me. I don't know if the iPhone XR does, but that's what I'm recording off of. And I mean, it's good. You can see me, but um, it could be better. But make sure you're recording in 4K if you have an upper or newest iPhone. I don't know if the, the, this one does it. I don't think it does because it just has 40 and 60. But anyways, like I'm saying, make sure you're recording in 4K and make sure your quality is good. Um, make sure you have a good lighting and make, and if you don't have a ring light, use your uh, window during the daytime. I think that's more better lighting than actual ring light, to be honest. Number seven is reply to every comment. Y'all. And I, I wrote this down so I can say it. It can encourage your audience and it can result in a large fan base. Plus, it makes your viewers come back. Don't be like some of these YouTubers. Don't reply back and make their, they're like big, they're famous, they're, they're so big, they just can't reply back. No. Um, because it just don't work like that because... No one will support you if you're going to be like that, you know. At least heart it or reply back. Um, they, like, love to see your comments. So, I mean, just reply back, you know, be nice and say thanks for watching. Or if they say they're a new subscriber, just say welcome, you know. Don't just ignore it. Just pay attention to your audience because that's what's going to keep coming back to you. Uh, every video you post. Uh, I've noticed that too, that some of my old subscribers come back. Thank y'all so much. I love each and every one of y'all. Okay, that was seven, I think. I should have numbered these, but I didn't. Number eight is find your niche. Um, your niche should be like what your videos are. Um, like I do like lifestyle, vlogs, uh, girl talks, um, stuff like that, you know make sure you have a niche and you stick with your niche um, maybe sometimes you want to switch it up you can uh, but have a niche number nine is do collabs I have not done a collab um, I, I have got a text saying uh, do a collab but um, I don't know I, I'm, I'm shy y'all I'm shy especially when it comes to new people but on camera I'm a whole different person in, in person, it's different. I don't know. I don't know. But I did get a text saying um, they wanted to wanted to collab, but I did not want to. So uh, I didn't do it because I just don't know where to even start from collabing because I never did one. So, But do collabs. Uh, push your videos or your channel out there. You can do a lot more like I'm doing to push my channel out, but do collabs, um, communicate with big YouTubers or small YouTubers, just collab with people. I should be doing it, but I'm not. Number 10 is switch up your content. Like I said, in the collab, I mean, not in the collab, but find your niche. Um, switch up your content every now and then. Don't do the same old, same old. Um, it, this is completely up to you. Um, if you want to switch up your content, go right ahead. Um, but, you know, just switch it up sometimes, you know. Maybe this will push your channel more, you know. 
because I've seen that happen, but I just, I don't, I don't know. Like, I don't know if it actually works. Y'all, my earring is hurting. Anyways, y'all. <laughs> but anyways, like I said, just switch up your content if you want to. If you don't, um, just, just come up with, uh, some good content, I guess. I don't know, y'all. <laughs> I keep saying weird stuff. Number 11 is be consistent. Um, yeah, Leslie. Yeah, I've been slacking. It's been like six days since I post, so um, we getting back on track. We posting all week. Uh, but like I said, um, be consistent. Have a schedule, which this is, I think, no. Maybe I don't have this written down on the notes. I hope I don't. But anyways, like I said, have a schedule. Uh, I did have a schedule. It was Tuesdays and Thursdays. Now that I went to work and I started working, it's messed up. So now we, we posting all week. Um, that is the goal for this week is to um, post all week so it's gonna be a video probably all week because um, you want to push your content out you know you want to gain views and views and views uh, number 12 is track your analytics now I do this every now and then um, like sometimes I check on it sometimes I don't because normally it don't change but it does change after maybe a week or a month pass um your analytics can drop if you don't post as much i remember one time i didn't post much that month and it dropped it dropped to like 200 but always uh check your analytics and um if you need to post more make sure it, it tell it shows you when to post more like if you're not at that goal or that one go that you want to be like at 1k or 2k views at your analytics uh maybe you need to post more um that's what i've been doing try to because i was hired now that i got the job and it kind of went downhill but we getting back up um but like i said uh track your analytics it'll definitely help um but that's that's that one so i'm not even gonna say the numbers no more I done lost count of it so the next one is create a playlist I have create a playlist uh, with all my videos and I have another playlist with my braces journey um, but if y'all want to go watch that go watch that help you grow out with the watch hours um, but uh, so if they like liked you and your channel and you know you're just entertaining to them they will watch your playlist and uh, I've done that before to Makaya I think Makaya, I'll put her YouTube up here, but I, I've watched her whole playlist, um, up to date with all her videos. Um, so if they like you and they want to see more of you, they'll go watch your playlist. So make a playlist and have all your videos up. That's what I did. You can go watch it if you want to. Um, but the next one is have an upload schedule. See, I knew I wrote this down. When did I, okay, yeah, this one matches with be consistent because my dumb, dumb self said it in the, but yeah, have a schedule, um, if it messes up, try and get back on track, um, if there's like school involved and sports involved, uh, try going around them and, you know, push out some content, even if it's on weekends and you're not, you're free, you have a lot of free time or you're sitting around and you're not doing anything girl you have all this free time make a video for real this will help you and i, I haven't learned the hard way to do it because you know job yeah you gotta you're gonna have to post 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 that's definitely the key post okay uh, the last one is add a youtube subscribe button to your videos yes this is very important I went crazy with it when I first started. I was at the beginning of the video and the after video, that's how it should be, but I feel like I'm getting on y'all's nerves with that. So I just put it at the end of the video or sometimes at the beginning of the video. So um, I was putting it in at both of them, but I'm trying to, I'm like, maybe they're like, maybe y'all are getting annoyed by seeing it. So I just put it one time in my video as long as it's like one time shown in your video, I think that will help you. Um, but 
make sure you have a, a subscribe button in your video. Also, make sure you have the watermark down below. It will be right here where my profile picture is. It'll say subscribe. Make sure you have a picture up there so they can see it or when they're on the laptop and they push full screen, they can hit the subscribe button while they, they push a full screen. See, see, be growing girl, be growing or boy, whoever. So if you came here for tips, these are all the tips that will help you gain subscribers. Um, always ask your friends to, to subscribe. And if your friends not gonna subscribe, your YouTube friends will subscribe and be your supporters. Just just interact with people for real to help your channel. Cause I, I've learned that like your real friends is not gonna help you with your channel. Maybe like your close ones, I'm, I'm close to two of them and they ha they subscribed to my channel. And I love them so much because they did that. But other people probably not gonna do it. So always share your video, get it out there. Just push yourself. Uh, if this is something you really, really want to do, go for it, go for it. But this is all for the 15 tips uh, of how to get 100 subscribers on YouTube. I hope I really helped y'all out and uh, it's good to be back on on YouTube. It, I've missed it a lot of recording and talking to y'all. I've missed it a lot. So I'm, I'm glad I'm back for real. I hope you all enjoyed this video. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe. Um, we're on the road to 700 subscribers. It's been a long road and I feel so happy and beyond happy. But uh, thank y'all so much. I love y'all. But anyways, um, I'll see you guys in the next video, which will probably be tomorrow. So, I'll see y'all.